this one time, me and my girlfriend were at a concert there, and I think she had the hearts for me, so... Okay, okay, I get the picture. Akihabara, huh? Wow, I gotta say, kid, you really know your stuff. Yup, yup. People tell me that a lot, you know. Like, they think I'm pretty wistful, wistful. <laughs> oh no, been fun chatting, but I better get back to work. Place will fall apart without me. Ah, uh, so we can go there now. Perfect. Let's go then. Alright. <clears throat> Excuse me, so we want to go to Akahabara. Let's have a look at info first. To many, Akahabara is a mecca of geek culture with its numerous electronic stores, made cafes and arcades. But under its cute exterior, it also holds a dark underbelly of exploitation that isn't often talked about publicly. Okay. Sorry, just adjusting my volume in my headphones. Right. Let's go then. See what's like, see what we can find. Okay. This looks good. Um, okay, so we can look here, talk to this guy. I just want to have a little wander around first. See what we've got. And we've got a lot of stuff by the looks of it. Jeez, okay. Um, well, as soon as we're here, at this end, we might as well start on this end. Um, can't interact with that guy, but we can enter here. Hello, miss. My name is Inoto. Do you mind if I ask you a few questions? Okay. Need to think of a voice. Um, huh? I'm the owner, Sachiko Akiyama. Say, you're not a health inspector or anything, right? We already had an inspection last week. Lucky for both of us, I'm not. I'm investigating something. I was wondering if you'd seen this girl in this photo. Hmm. Well, uh, honestly, she kind of looks a, a little like all the other girls around here. You know, the maids and stuff. I don't know much about it. it makes two of us. I feel a, a little out of my depth around here. Oh, sorry about him. He could be a little bit too friendly sometimes. Ah, oh, hello there, little one. What's your name? That's Tomo. You might not be able to touch him right now. He's a little sick. He's been making some uh, messes, if you know what I mean, out of both ends. Guess you can see why I was a bit concerned earlier. I took it to the vet this morning, but they can't figure out it out either, and they told me to wait it out, and I think it's getting worse. Sorry to hear that. Does this sort of thing happen often? No, 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 of course not. My cat's... Uh, get all the best care. They're fed the best food, are on the best kitty card over routines, and are pampered day and night. I even read, read the paper to them to make sure that they're up to date on current events. But poor Tomo, maybe I should go and ask the cat collector. Cat collector? Yeah, she's a breeder who lives around here who specialises in knowing everything feline. Oh, Tomo, not on the rug, and he threw up again. I'm sorry, can you excuse me for a second? Not a problem. I'll come back another time. Hope he's fo he feels better soon. So there's a cat cafe! <laughs> Sorry, I can't help it. I just... Ah, uh, it's so freaking cute. But we can't pet any of the cats, so... We're just gonna have to go. God damn it. Right, okay. So... That was the cat cafe. Um, so this, I'm guessing this is the cat made cafe that that guy was talking about, so we might as well go in. Yeah! <laughs> I'm going to have to do a really cutesy voice. Uh uh. Welcome, gentle mistress. I'm Inoka Nya! What's your name? Uh, yes, hi. I'm a Yami. No! <laughs> Yami, no! <laughs> your table with us will be ready in just a few minutes. We apologize for the wait and hope that you can forgive us. Does the mistress have a membership card? No, I don't. Hey, hold on! Take your hands off me! It's important that I personally guide you to a table, no, and yeah? Yeah! Perfect! There we are. Don't you feel better? Actually, I was hoping we could talk about... Oh yes, Mistress Ahim and yeah? <laughs> That option is included on the menu under full, full access... Uh, oh god, this is ridiculous. Um... A communication. <laughs> it's only, it's only a hundred, a thousand yen extra, and then you can ask all the questions you want. Yay! 
But if you want pictures, you have to order the pretty Jackie photo <laughs> option. Only a thousand yen per photo. Yay! I think you have gotten the wrong impression. I'm clearly starving. Mistress, where are my manners? That wasn't very polite of me. Can you take this humble servant fetch something for you? No, hold on, you're not listening. I only want to ask you about a photo. Oh, mistress, you're so hungry you don't even remember me explaining the pretty Jackie photo option. You've gone delirious. We'll get you food soon. We have the nine pan nine cakes, parberry cheesecake. That sounds actually quite good. Perry stow pasta. <laughs> and all our available to come in a drink set. I'm oh this actually looks quite cutesy, but I need to ask you some questions. Um Hmm Let's start with I'm a detective. I think you might have the wrong idea about me. I'm a detective with the Tokyo Metropolitan Police Department and I'm going to assist you answer my questions. Oh my! Does that mean I'm it, it, that does seem serious. I would love to help you. Just one little tiny detail first. May I see your badge? Excuse me? I certainly wouldn't want to offend you, Ay <laughs> Ayamina. But there are lots of cosplayers in this town. That The costumes can be really good. Oh, I, uh, I don't have it on me right now. No badge, huh? How convenient. <laughs> oh my god, I can't do it. <laughs> I certainly haven't met any female detectives before. Something smells fishy. I uh, don't mean in a good way. Yeah? Yes, but... Well, detective, let's stick to the rules, okay? Oh. My fashion's all done. So I can on the photo. Uh, order the pancakes. Mmm. Let's order the pancakes. Okay. Okay, okay. I'll have the, uh, let's see here. The Nyan Pan Nyan Cakes and the Pretty Katie. Oh, excellent choice, Ayama Nyan. Those are, the, those are very popular items on our menu. Right, so I ordered. That means I can finally ask you about this. Before your order arrives, you must first do the ultra secret Nyan Pan Fan Cheer. Nyan Pan what? Do I have to? Come on, surely I don't need to do anything, something silly like that. <laughs> But I assist the yum and yum. One can't, can't taste the love cooked in the yum pan yum pan cakes unless it's released by the yum pan fan cheer. <sighs> Fine, you win. What do you want me to do? <laughs> Excellent, mistress. Already, I can feel the love pouring from your kind heart. Let's begin. Please place your paws in the air like this. Like this. Perfect, yum yum. Are you sure you haven't done this before? No. You must repeat the, the sacred verses. Oh my god. Nyan mellow, nyan pelo, nyan wallow pa. What? God. Nyan mellow, nyan pelo, nyan wallow pa. Uh. Nyan me. Ah ah, and don't forget to raise your paws. <laughs> This is ridiculous. Uh, my professionalism is going to go way down after this. Yan Melo, Nan Palo, Nan Wello Poor. Unbelievable! The passion, the vigor! I can feel the love pouring into the room, Nan Yan. You know. Oh, no, that's wrong. You know, I can't lie. I do feel like a little bit of my negativity just flew out of me. Now that I said the cheer, can we. Oh my goodness, Mistress! Tanyan, your pancakes have arrived! That was so quick. Hold on. You didn't tell me that the Nyan Nyan pancakes were shaped like little cats. Oh yeah! They're painstakingly made with love by our staff. But there's a little crippling tail. It's so cute. Nyan! Now Nyan Chan was saying something about a picture, as I recall. Uh, hold up. No need to rush things. We can't talk on, a, on an em empty stomach, right? <laughs> that's so cute. Pressure has gone down, but sanity's gone up. Okay, that's not too bad. Does your maid soft actually make these? Because they're ama they were amazing. Of course, they are, Yam. And now you've eaten it, I'll be happy to answer any questions you have. Oh, right, that. Have you ever seen this girl in this photo? Let's see. Yeah! 
Whoa, are you alright? I am concentrating to my fullest, Yan Min Yan. Oh, but this young mistress is not familiar to me, Nya. I see. Well, thanks anyway. That dress is so pretty. It looks like it was custom made. I've seen a lot. Some. I've seen some of that quality before, Nyan. Maybe you should ask the collector. She's a fashion designer at Akabara, who designs costumes for the major idols who don't have a big budget. Collector, huh? How can I find her? Excuse me. Sorry. A little hiccup there. Supposedly, she has a shop on this very street. Supposedly? She's a very mysterious lady, Yan. Yeah, My co-worker, Mina Nyan, has met her. Her shift starts soon. You should ask her about it. I will. Thanks. Oh, and, um... Next time, can I get a picture of the pancakes? I ate them so quickly that I forgot. Of course, Yan. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Right, so we got to wait for this other girl to come onto her shift. That's fine. We can go ask some more people, people about some stuff. Look, enter, look, look. Though the two guys standing outside the ramen shop look foreign, I can hear them speaking fluent sounding Japanese. They're pouring over what looks like a map and some drawings. Um, I'll tell you what, let's just, let's talk to them. Hi, I don't mean to be rude, but I couldn't help but notice all the maps and notes you guys are passing back and forth. Seems kind of intense. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna go... Maybe I should do Cockney, <laughs> Cockney London. No! <laughs> that was terrible. Nah. No, no thank you. Oh, sorry. Thought you were gonna hand us a flyer. We ducked in here to escape a very persistent mage. You're not a mage in disguise, are you? Ha! <laughs> No, I doubt I could summon the pep required to be a maid for 10 minutes, let alone all day. I was just curious about what you two were doing. Okay. Undercovering all the hidden secrets in a Kabira, of course. What about you? Um, something kind of similar, actually. But you guys seem a lot more well-versed in the area than I am. How far back do these side streets go, anyway? Oh boy, don't even know half of it. There's some old mazes of electronic stores still selling computers and radio parts and how about everything else you can imagine? We decided to map out the area. Bit of an urban exploration. I'm sure it's not very original, but I, it's been a fun side project. Akabora is a fascinating area, that's for sure. Urban exploration, huh? Sounds interesting. Most of my friends just sleep on their days off. Are you guys English teachers? Oh, me? Nah, I'm a writer. Well, an aspiring writer. I only got a few a few gigs. I'm a web de developer in my day job. But it's projects like this that give me the fuel for creative fibre. Fire even, not fibre. Who knows, maybe you'll be reading something and you'll find an anecdote about how conversation is, is it. This conversation in it someday. I'm an artist. Graphic designer on the side. Cody here commissioned me to come here with him and make ske ske some sketches as we explore the city f for the book he's working on. Huh. I never would have guessed people would be doing this, doing things like that. What kind of book are you writing? Urban Aura. Neon Noor is going clean streets of Tokyo. I doubt you believe some of the things that go on in the city even if I told you. I wouldn't. You might, you might be surprised how much I'm willing to believe. So, have you been mapping out this street? Any interesting about it? Interesting might not be word I'd use. I've been getting some kind of weird vibe around here. I mean, on the surface, it looks like it's any other side street in like a Akubaha. It's got stuff you'd expect. Smoky Arcade, Caf, uh, Maid Caf, Cat Caf, Carnival Bookstores. Nothing unusual here. Not in uh, Akubaha, anyway. So far, so good. We're almost ready to move on, but... See that elevator over there? Yeah, sure. What about it? That's normal, right? Well, looks to be deceiving. Yeah, we've got a little pet theory about it. Get this, we think. You think it eats people? You think the elevator eats people? We've been staking it out for the last few days. As far as we can tell, it doesn't belong to any store in that building. Ah, get this. Only lets certain people in. And then when they get in, never see them come back out. Yeah, go ahead and try it. We have. So, logically, it's either eating people or the cues of vampires. I thought a lot about it. Pretty sure it might be a thing. I mean, there's a lot of shady activity around here. 
Damn, Sion, that might be the book. The Yakuza Vampire of Akaba. Write this down. What? Oh, I'm doing better writing it down. I'm already making some sketches. I think this might be the best of years you've had all week, Cody. Didn't you say something? You knew some Hollywood agent in LA? Oh, they're American. I thought they were, but I didn't want to be stereotypical. Yeah. About once we write this, there's no way they can ignore it. Vampires are all the range. Or well, they were. Bring them, bring them back. You guys certainly have a hell of an imagination. Take it from me, this city has a lot of strange things that happen in real life too. Trust me, you start asking around, you'll be surprised what people will tell you. So what, is that the, or is this the elevator? The elevator is out of service. So yeah, I think they're talking about that one. Um, let's go in to this ramen place. Ooh, I like the music. Ask about photos. Hi, sorry to bother you. I'm Ayami. What's your name? Um. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm Amoko. Whatever you want, make it quick. I'm kind of waiting for someone, so. Alright, I'll cut to the chase. Can you tell me anything about this photo? Uh, what decade is that dress from? Wait, Glow 6? Uh oh, this isn't some idle thing, is it? If you're from some modeling agency or whatever, I can tell you right now, there's no way I'll wear that kind of gothic lotia stuff. No, nothing like that. I'm an investigator of sorts. I'm less interested in fashion and more about the girl, her girl herself. Should I know? I also feel so boring. Hey, are you like the investigators on TV? Did that girl cheat with some guy's wife or something? This is so exciting. You know what you should do? You should totally ask the collector about that photo. What kind of collector? No, the collector. That is like a game he gives himself. The guy knows everything there is around here. My friend Arkane told me about it. If the girl's an Akahabara, I bet he knows about it. Why? Is that guy an expert on idols or something? No, weren't you listening? Like I said, he knows everything. Which shops are employing foreigners illegally? Who's behind on their rent? Hell, he even knows which capsule machines have the rarest stuff. At least that's what I've heard. No offence, but why would some high school, no <laughs> high school girl need information like that? Well, that's... it's complicated. I came works around here part-time and there was a customer who used to come in and kind of obsess over her, you know? A real creep. Before long, he was following her home. She complained, but her boss wouldn't believe her, so I came asked the collector to give her something to make that widow go away. And did he? Sure did. He gave her a photo of that guy she was mailing to, to the creep's wife. Let's just say it was incriminating. What do you get out of it, this collector? Why don't you ask her cane herself? She's out with someone right now, but should be back any minute. Thanks, I'm okay. I think I might just do that, so we've got to wait for two people now. Let's ask about the collector as well. Like I said, I don't really know much. Ask her cane, she'll be back soon. Okay, you don't know anything. That's fine, let's go. No one seems to know anything about Reyna, but every time I brought her up, I heard the same name over and over. The Collector. It was the only clue I had, and I knew that if I was going to go any, get any further in this case, there was a thread I needed to follow. Right, okay. Oh, those guys are gone now. We can't enter there. Is there anywhere else? You talk to this guy. On any other day, I, I'd probably enjoy messing with a mouth reader like this, but I doubt he knows anything about Pop Idols or Arena. I should move on for now. Oh, okay. Right, so we can't go in there, so I reckon we go back to the cat cafe. Let's see if that person's on their shift now.